2018 Subaru Crosstrack on its original battery. Drove this a couple of days ago. I noticed in the last two weeks when I start the car, it cranks really slow. So it makes sense. It's the original battery, five years old. So And looks like it's going to need a new battery. <laughs> All right, let's turn this off. This is going to be a review on the NOCO Genius 5. This is supposed to restore old batteries, and this battery is about five years old. Disconnected the negative terminal. It's hooked up, so let's go ahead and charge this battery right there. This should charge fairly fast. The battery is just not holding charge. The, the voltage isn't high anymore, so this should be green within an hour. I'm going to run some errands right now. I'll be back in an hour, and this should be green by then, by the time I come back. Battery's fully charged. I'm going to go ahead and go into repair mode. All you have to do is hold the power button down, and then it'll go here, and then press it one more time. That's repair mode. When that stops blinking, and... The indicator is there, it's done. So let's do that one more time. There you go, repair mode. Repair mode will take a couple of hours. It's done. Now let's go ahead and see if the car starts up. And then if it'll continue to start up, that's the question. Let's go ahead and start the car. Alright, it's one thing to start the car up. The question is now, will it continue to start up? I'm gonna go ahead and uh, drive this to work today and bring my jump start box just in case. So there you go, car started up. Alright, just got off of work. Start this up. It's a good start up. Take a look at the date here. It is Monday the 17th, 2023. So I'm gonna drive this car to work this week and then perfect opportunity to see how this battery holds a charge. I'm gonna let it sit for like four days after this current work week. So there you go, there's the date. This car sat for five days, started right up before I headed to work. Leaving work now, let's try it again. Starts right up, and here's the date coming up. The 26th. So it looks like this uh, battery restore worked great. Battery has uh, extra life in it. It's been more than a month since I used the repair mode on this NOCO Genius 5. This car has been sitting for about five days, so let's go ahead and start it up. Let's take a look at the date here. Today is August 24, 2023. About a six month update on this NOCO Genius 5 battery restore. Today is January 14, 2024. Did the restore on July 17, 2023. So let's try this out. Still working. Let's get the date right there. 1-14-2024. When you jump start a car, the reason why it won't start up again on the old battery is because the old battery is no longer holding a charge. You just basically borrowed battery power from another source. So that's what the NOCO Genius 5 does. It restores the battery's capacity so you're able to start the car again. It's like the, it's basically what it does. It restored the battery. So right now I'm on six months of the restored battery. So I'll do an update video when this finally no longer works. So right now we're at six months. So that NOCO Genius 5 gave this battery six months of life 
and who knows how long it'll last I just feel like six months is pretty good so that's why I'm uploading this video now I'll do an update if this video lasts or um, this battery lasts another six months then that means this battery will be six years old if it lasts another six months so Noco Genius 5 gave this battery minimum six months of life so I'll keep you guys updated on how long this battery lasts original battery on a 2018 Subaru Crosstrack I bought this to restore the solar batteries in my van now I could use this to restore the batteries in my vehicles and restore the batteries on my loved ones and friends cars so if you found this video helpful give it a thumbs up this channel is self-funded and whatever funds I make off of this channel I do reviews like this and work on my car projects